There are a lot of ways to make energy. Coal, oil, solar, nuclear, hydro, even wind. But here at Princeton University, we use a jet engine. We have a co-generation plant producing half of the campus power right under our nose. And behind me is the co-generation plant. We built this in uh, 1996. It provides all the steam for the campus for heating. Uh, it provides all of the chilled water for the campus for cooling. And we make about half of the electricity for the campus here as well. What is co-generation? And how does it work? The cogen plant is natural gas fired. Uh, we use a gas turbine or a jet engine. It is almost exactly the stealth fighter or the FA-18 engine. We spin uh, the jet engine by burning natural gas and that turns an electric generator. That makes electricity and about a third of the energy we buy goes into making electricity. The other two thirds comes out as hot exhaust from a gas turbine and that is what we use to make steam for the campus, and that's really the co in the co-generation. We're making both electricity and steam. The co-generation plant at Princeton was started as a way to save money. In fact, it actually saves more money and energy than Princeton's entire 27-acre solar field. Princeton's co-generation facility generates so much power that we can isolate ourselves from the power grid, so we can run as a little island uh, when needed, when the power grid fails. The most notable was during Hurricane Sandy, uh, when most of the state was dark. And on campus, we were able to produce power for most of the campus and keep all core business activities uh, running without interruption. Wait a second. Does this mean Princeton is going off the grid? You know, just the opposite. I actually feel like the more that we generate, uh, the more we need to dance with the utility. We benefit tremendously from our relationship with the utility and being connected to them. There's times that we're actually selling power into the grid for a benefit for the university. What's in store for the future of the cogeneration plant? Uh, we're working on a lot of uh, marginal changes, changes that actually reduce by some percent the amount of energy we need to deliver uh, the same amount of utilities to the campus. In 20 to 35 years, we may have a completely different way of thinking about energy on campus. So every day when you're plugging in your laptops, turning on showers, or flicking on lights, remember that power can come from anywhere, but how we're making it is making a difference.